Hello, this is Daniel Mart, and today I'm gonna be discussing about the recently released um Captain America Winter Soldier trailer that that kind of came out with the Super Bowl, but this one's gonna be the extended edition. They sent out two. One was like a teaser, and this one's uh an actual extended trailer. Um, the other one was a teaser trailer, which as you can tell, annotation at the top for those who wanna check it out. But, you know, besides the point. Um, yeah, so basically this one's about two and a half minutes long. And yeah, you do, there are a few key points here. Um, yeah, you do have a few couple good lines. At the beginning, I am, um, you have Scarlett Johansson and um, Black Widow saying, um, talking, basically talking about Winter Soldier. And basically, and basically what she says is that most of the intelligence communi community doesn't believe he exists and the ones that do call him the Winter Soldier, and then he's a ghost, you'll never find him. Um, then this other guy, I, have, I still have no idea who the hell this guy is, um, but he's basically saying to build a better world, sometimes you have to turn the old one down, and then at also, also towards the end, you have Captain America saying, the cost of freedom is high, and price I'm I'm willing to pay, and that I mean, and that is the price I'm willing to pay. So yeah. Now one of the key points I want to do point out was with the second quote is to build a better world. Sometimes you have to turn the old ones down. It was kind of interesting, an interesting quote. And then, you know, you kind of see like, kind of tell you could you could kind of tell um Captain America like saying, you know, this isn't right. You know, we should go back to how it was because this isn't the world we should be living in type of thing. It just doesn't feel right. You do see a bit more of Winter Soldier as he's beginning. Um, uh, yeah. I mean, you see him on this like chair. He's kind of delusional, and he's with this like robotic arm. And then the next thing you see him like also laying down, also checking out his robotic arm. I have some here. No, forget it. Um. So yeah. Honestly, that that was pretty cool. You know, see how the Winter Soldier came to be the Winter Soldier, but obviously we all know who Winter Soldier is, Bucky, or for those who don't follow the comics, he would have been the equivalent. Or I think he is. I don't know. I didn't rewatch the first one, but whatever. He would have been the. He would have been close or the equivalent of the same guy who fell off the train, and that you know that one mountain train scene. You know, he he's the one. He would have been the one. So yeah, um, yeah. So yeah, that that was a pretty cool trailer in my opinion. Um, there is a pretty interesting point. Um, they kind of point out towards it a lot, and it does seem like we're gonna see a major character death in this movie. Um, you see, and I think it's hinting a lot towards Samuel L. Jackson's character Nick Fury, and there's. A huge point, many points in it. Um, I mean, you do see him in a car crash, and then you see him very beaten up, and then they they kind of leave us wondering at this one point where, where, um, what's her name? Black Widow. She's about to open the open this like body bag or something. You see her, Captain America. Her, I can't tell if it was a doctor or if it was Falcon. Um, but you see someone else with them. And it's just, you know, and for sure it's not um, Nick Fury, because, you know, but it does kind of hint um, that we may see the death of Nick Fury, you know, who basically built the Avengers and S.H.I.E.L.D. He's basically one of the key characters of this whole thing. Maybe he does that, that would be very tragic. Uh, but... And I can actually see him dying in this movie, in this installment, which is uh, not a good thing, but whatever. Um, and I guess you have to have some kind of major event in these um, movies in order for us to remember them and, you know, give them awards or whatever. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, it's a doctor. Sorry. Um, I, I found a scene. It's a, it's a doctor. Yeah, you have Captain America, Scarlet, um, Black Widow, I mean, and then Spotty Bag thing, whatever. Besides point, so yeah. It will be interesting if we do see a character death, but whatever, besides point, I mean, besides the whole, um, possibility of us seeing a major character death and, uh, Winter Soldier, 
um, being made, you know, his origins and, you know, a few quotes. You do have a lot of action scenes, um, which is good in this, in my opinion. I mean, and bad at the same time. I mean, on one hand, it is good, you know, because at least, you know, it's action packed. But on the other hand, you know, they're showing too much of the cards. So that's not good. But whatever, um, this trailer does make me want to watch the whole thing, the whole movie by now. comes out in April, so I guess I'm, I'm just going to have to wait, you know, April 4th. So yeah, I'm, I guess I'm just going to have to wait. Um, so yeah, two months, whatever. I, I could hold out that long. But uh, this is one of my most anticipated movies of this year. Well, it is the most anticipated movie of this year for me. So, you know, I am yeah, very excited to see it. Um, so, yeah, that's basically it. Um, I will put a link down in the description below for those who want to check out the trailer and, and annotation for those who want to check out my review on a teaser. Um, yeah, I did see in the teaser that we did see a bit of Anthony Mackie or Falcon. Um, we did see a little bit of him, a little bit more in the teaser, and I think we saw a little bit, uh, much more of him in this, um, this trailer. I mean, you have this one scene where Winter Soldier, he, like, gets his grabbing hook or something. He... Th those guys wings and just brings him down. I mean, that was a pretty awesome scene, in my opinion. Opinion, but whatever. Um, again, I will put a link down below for trailer and annotation somewhere up here for those who want to check it out and you know check out the my previous review on the teaser. So yeah, that's basically it for this review. Um, subscribe. I also do other one. Um, I also review other Captain America things, um, comic books and movies, maybe, whatever. I um, also review other comic books, TV shows, movies, trailers, so, you know, stay tuned for that. Um, comment below your thoughts on the on the trailer and, you know, are you excited to see this movie besides that? Um, share on Instagram, Facebook, MySpace, Twitter, Vine, or whatever you guys prefer. Oh, and comment below on your thoughts. Do you think Nick Fury will bite dust in this installment? Um, so yeah, that's basically it. Share, you know, Instagram, Facebook, buy my space, Twitter, whatever you guys prefer. That's basically it. This is Daniel Mart signing off.